Hello everyone, my name is Anders Rare. I'm a financial economics major. I'm Jacob Gonzalez, and I'd just like to start off by thanking everyone for coming tonight, uh, and to Marta and Russ and the leadership committee for orchestrating all the events leading up till now, um, and to everyone who has helped us along the way in progressing our idea to get us to the point that we are at now. Thank you for everything that you've done. So our company, Rapport Visuals, is a multi-angle videography company that finds innovative ways to assist individuals and professionals by utilizing the latest technology and camera techniques. Throughout our presentation, we will be showcasing some of our editors, past work of commercial real estate and residential, as well as a recently shot virtual tour of Beck Hall. If you look at any given real estate property listing today, you will see an abundance of still shot photography, which leads us to the problem we are currently facing a failure by commercial industries to utilize aerial technology and innovational multi-angle videography to its fullest capacity, causing firms to operate in a fashion that is not profit maximizing. We will solve this problem by providing multi-angle videography services and products to clients in a way that will cut their existing costs and add value to their property. Our current target market and opportunity lies in commercial and residential real estate. We will be providing promotional marketing videos to these individuals. This will be done through our extensive network that consists of executives at CBRE, Cushman and Wakefield, Travelers and Colliers, just to name a few. Using our network will allow our company quite literally to take flight. In the future to expand our sales and target market, we will be actively networking through various real estate associations and LinkedIn to establish even more connections. Taking an economic approach, we will see that in the production function, holding all other variables constant, Technical progress results in higher output, shifting the production possibility curve right. This being stated, we will capture technological advancement in regards to multi-angle videography and offer firms a desired increase of output through our multiple avenues of service. With, with the exception of a few firms in California and on the East Coast, the market is essentially void of any competition. The demand is present, but the supply is non-existent. With careful proceedings, we have the potential to capture a large portion of the commercial market in between the Rockies and Appalachians when it comes to multi-angle videography. With experience and capital accumulation, Report Visuals will expand its services to cater to the needs of other industries such as commercial, such as construction, agriculture, insurance, and entertainment. With our expansion of services, we'll allow Report <coughs> Visuals to capture even a larger market share of this newly emerging market that's been valued by Goldman Sachs at $100 billion by the year 2020. Our current technology and equipment that we will be using is essential to aiding in completing our mission of providing innovative solutions to professionals, individuals. The equipment that I have here today is, as you can see, is the transformation of the technology from the Phantom 3 to the DJI Inspire 2, which we use for our aerial photography and the Matterport 360 camera to create the virtual tours. <clears throat> Moving on to discuss our competitive advantage and competition, we view ourselves as having a buying edge deriving from the quality of our service and products, as well as the comprehensive professional network that we have built. And as we previously mentioned, there's currently a lack of multi-angle videography providers specializing in aerial imaging for commercial purposes, specifically in the Midwest. Top firms in this industry consist of Kespri, Airware, Esri, and AirMap in California, as well as Raptor Maps, Precision Hawk, and Sci-Fi Works on the East Coast. These firms have displayed how viable this new market really is by exhibiting rapid growth and innovation. The idea of our company came from one of our co-founders, Tanner Raw, when he was in high school. He quickly realized the capabilities of drones and the power that aerial imaging has. With these, with these new ideas in mind, he tried forming a company at the time, but wasn't able to because of harsh regulation by the FAA that restricted the use of commercial drone operation. With the passing of Part 107 certification, has now allowed for our company to take flight. With, through actively seeking informational interviews, we were able to bring light to the other possibilities of drones that we explained earlier. And with these new possibilities in mind, Report Visuals knew that it needed a bigger management team if we wanted to complete our objective of getting into these other emerging industries. And that is when we brought on Joe Schultz, Cody Rodenz, Joe Thyler, and Anders Rara. Combining our individual strengths will allow our company <coughs> to accomplish our mission of becoming part of this newly emerging industry. 
In regards to financial matters, we have projected all of our VC's expe expenses consisting of a DJI Inspire 2 drone, Matterport camera and cloud service, iPad Pro, tripod, QuickBooks, articles of organization, operati operating agreement, website, independent contract wages, business insurance, banking fees, and office supplies. The cost of goods sold will consist of the equipment, insurance, and independent contractor, keeping marginal costs at an impressively low level. Our capital expenditure is the physical inventory we have already purchased, which totals to $10,788. Additionally, we have our first job already on the schedule for next Saturday at a 60,000 square foot office space. We will achieve profitability in our first year of operation. The initial investment cover all startup costs, which enables us to begin providing services to clients immediately. In our cash flow estimates, we project that we will break even in the first six months. It is worth noting that this is only a humble projection of RVC revenues. Regarding the current status of our company, we are currently registered with the Minnesota Secretary of State, registered with the IRS for an EIN number, have a business bank account with Wells Fargo, Part 107 certification with the FAA, and have essential capital accumulated for equipment purchases in addition to the extensive client list that we have established. Also, we are currently in the process of bidding on a national exclusive dealership contract with CBRE and plan to start this process with many of the aforementioned firms in the near future. As Andres had said, we have already obtained the necessary financing to go ahead and purchase all of this equipment to allow us to be operational. We are seeking additional capital that will allow us to create a professional website to aid in our ability of reaching more clients through the internet. The, as well as the additional capital will help us with having enough capital on hand in case any unforeseen contingencies were to occur during the course of operation. To conclude, Rapport Visuals Company, or value to companies, while cutting their existing costs. The combination of the lack of competition and the superiority of our product will allow for us to capture a significant portion of the market, of which the demand is not currently being met. Our low marginal costs and elite professional network will propel RVC to the level of profitability exhibited by corporate giants. We look forward to this opportunity that lays before us, and we'd love to provide our services to some of you here today. Thank you. Well, uh, besides, we are going to be completing all the work ourselves, so um, there's going to be no wage fees um, for our company initially. And as far as cost, we already have our equipment right here. What's the charge to the company that's hired you? How much are they paying? Well, we're, we haven't reached a price right now. The price per job really depends on what the what our client wants because you know every marketing video that we do is going to be unique as you saw from examples. No two marketing videos are going to be the same. So it's going to be a per bid job and we realistically won't be able to, we will have our rough estimate is around $2,000 of our going rate for the next year of a building. Yeah, and uh, yeah, right now videography firms are offering, uh, offering similar services but uh, without the virtual tour or 3D imaging that Joel has displayed to you here. And that's going for about $999 on a residential level. Um, we haven't found any competitors who list price online. Everything is on a per quote basis. So we are planning on quoting on property value and square footage. So what's the price? I'm a real estate guy, so I speak the language. Right, the price right. Per square roughly, foot. price per square foot. Well, on average, I think we would say about 2000 to 7000 on a commercial space. And that's with a full marketing video and a 3D model. You mentioned um, in your costs as independent contractors. Once you go beyond just yourselves doing the work, will you hire people or will you work with Ab photographers in the area? Absolutely. And that's where future funding is going to come in. Um, as soon as we can have the funding, we're going to bring editors on board fully and not have that as an independent contractor service. In the current editor that you saw who produced all these videos is, he's one of the lead editors at Airviews, which is a drone social media sharing platform where they only have drone media, drone shot videos on their web page. And you know, once we prove that we have a proven strategy in company, he is willing to come over and start helping us. We've already established that. Yeah. Let's hear it for